Hi everybody, welcome to week four of Heather's Halloween collaboration. And this week is anything goes, we can make anything we want. So I am going to share with you what I made for my partner. So I made this little envelope book and here is the front. I have a Tim Holtz rosette and one of these bows that I cut on my Cricut Maker. I have a cut apart from, it's not really cut apart, it was one of the papers and I just cut the skeleton out by hand. I have a couple of die cuts here. The spine is made of just nice black paper, and here is the back. I used a couple of metal pieces for the whole closure and some chain and a lobster clasp here. So I'm going to open that for you. Okay. So you open the book, and I put what our collaboration is on the front cover, and then on the back cover, I put a piece of the paper. And it's got a lot of gold foiling, which is really pretty. I didn't do any decorating on the actual envelopes because the book was already getting chunky. The book is made from the Pink Abu collection, like the rest of the goodies from the collaboration. And I made all the envelopes on my envelope punch board and they are all closed with a Velcro closure. So in the first envelope, I have some of the crepe paper rosettes that I made. Okay. And the next one, I have some Halloween stickers and I changed out the toppers just to make it more fun. Alrighty. In the third envelope, I have a sequin mix and I use this in one of my ghostly shakers and a little spoon to pull it out with. I love this mix, it's so pretty. I've never been a huge purple fan, like I like it, but I'm not in love with it, but this collection has made me love me some purple. In the next envelope I have, okay, so the next two I'll show you. So I die cut some Alina Craft I don't know what you would call these. I guess bobbin holders, thread holders, ribbon holders, whatever. And I put some of my favorite trims that I've collected. I went into my hard vault. And so you have a bunch of different purples on this one. And then I will show you guys these and then I will close them up and then I will come back to the video. So here we go. And then in this one, I have some black and whites. Sorry, I gotta get into camera black and white and gray that she could use. And then in the last envelope, I have a bunch of like the pinky purples that are in this collection that would match. So there's those. And I really love using fibers. I love how pretty they are. I've hoarded forever and I'm starting to break them out. So I wanted to share. Okay, so I will be right back with the whole thing. Okay, so that was my pages four and five. And I love how my little book came out for my swap partner and I hope that she will enjoy it as well. And then I'm gonna show you the rest of my goodies just that you saw from the rest of the week. So um, for week one, let's see if I can zoom out a little bit without showing you too much of my mess. For week one, it was our shakers, which are the ghosties that I made. For week two, it was embellishments and I made these and these. For week three, it was the memory decks card. This is how I ended up decorating it and you just open it from the, or I'm sorry, packaging it. You open it from the back like that. And then it's just in this cute little packaging here, easy to take out. And then for week four, I've got this guy. So thank you so much for tuning into this collaboration. Please go check out the other gals that are participating in it. And this has been so fun. I'm so grateful to Heather for hosting this wonderful collaboration. Thanks so much for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.